the vast majority of people are in financial distress. And because of this, they don't have the freedom and flexibility to fulfill God's plan and purpose for their lives. In this session, I'm going to share some practical insights and ideas with you that you can start implementing today to get out of financial distress. Or maybe you are not even in financial distress, you are okay, but you are not yet in that place of abundance. The steps I am going to prescribe today will help you to start moving in that direction of abundance so that you will be free to do everything that God has laid in your heart, to be free to fulfill your aspirations and actualize your dreams. Let me share some thoughts with you from the book of Proverbs. Then we're going to build on that and share practical steps that we need to take. Okay? Proverbs chapter 13, verse 22 to verse 23. Proverbs 13, verse 22 to verse 23. I will read from the English Standard Version. Then I'll also read from the Amplified Version. You can read from several translations to help you understand the thoughts better. Now, I'm reading from the English Standard Version. A good man leaves an inheritance to his children's children, but the sinner's wealth is laid up for the righteous. The fallow ground of the poor would yield much food, but it is swept away through injustice. Now, let's read it from the Amplified. A good man leaves an inheritance to his children's children, and the wealth of the sinner is stored up for the hands of the righteous. Abundant food is in the fallow, uncultivated ground of the poor. But without protection, it is swept away by injustice. A lot of people that are in financial distress are in that position because they are consuming more than they are producing. So you want to be more of a producer than a consumer. But there are some other people that they are actually producing a lot, but what they are producing is swept away as a result of injustice. For example, maybe you are in an organization and you know it is clear, the data shows it, that your contributions are responsible for sustaining that organization. But you are not paid at that level. Okay, you are just paid you know, a pittance, which does not match your level of contribution. Now, the truth is, for most employees, the contribution they are making is negligible. The contribution they are making is even, it is dispensable. If they leave the organization, nobody will feel it for most employees. But it is not all. There are some people that are very productive, yet they are not getting enough value in return for their productivity because they have not built the kind of systems and structure to protect their productivity in such a way that they can also get the value that is due to them. In this session, I'll be sharing some steps with you that you can use to convert your skills into high-level productivity in such a way that you can also capture value in return. Now, when we think about injustice, many times we look at injustice as something that others do to us or something that someone does to someone else. But many times, injustice is also what we do to ourselves because we're not thoughtful and diligent in the way we do our work and in our approach to life in general. So you are being unjust to yourself when you are supposed to go about your work in a certain way, you are supposed to think through and see how to get value from what you are doing. But instead of thinking through, you just, you know, do, just do it, just do it. Okay, okay, what text can I do now? Okay, what, uh, you know, what is it that they are doing that they are making money from? Okay, you learn about cryptocurrency, for example, and then you start okay, doing that. You, you don't understand it. You, you have not thought through. You learn that, oh, you can make money from e-commerce. Okay, you want to try that. Okay, and you know, so you are the one perpetrating injustice to yourself when you adopt that kind of approach to life. Now, this scripture that we just read says that there is much food, okay, in the tillage of the poor, or there is much, you know, produce in the fallow ground, the uncultivated ground of the poor. So you have uncultivated ground, and it's not about looking for gold elsewhere, going up and down. It's about looking at your own ground. What is it that I have on this ground that I can get value from? How can I capture value from what I already have instead of running up and down, running elter skelter? Look at the story of the widow that went to meet Prophet Elisha, for example. Creditors came, they wanted to take away her sons because her husband holds money before he died. And Prophet Elisha said, what do you have in your house? 
you understand a lot of people are looking how to was but there's something you have in your house she said don't have anything but a little jar of oil elisha said that is enough and then elisha gave, gave her the strategy to multiply that little jar of oil in such a way that she could now go and sell and pay off her debt and also live on the rest so what she had was very valuable but she did not know how to translate it she did not know how to package it in such a way that it would pay off her debt and also have enough left to live off on the rest in the same way i am telling you categorically by the grace of god and i am telling you you already have everything you need to live financially free what you just need to do is to learn how to package it and convert it into the right forms that will help you achieve the financial freedom and the level of income that you desire so in this session i'm going to be sharing some practical steps with you which are the steps that i have taken up to this point and which if you take those steps also you are also going to achieve significant change in your financial situation and you will get to the point where you always have enough and more than enough and you are able to even help others the first thing i'm going to ask you to do is to sign up for an athlete program now what does it mean to sign up as an athlete or to be an athlete for a product or a service the point is that the only way to make money like the only way to take control of your finances in terms of how much income you earn is to have something to sell if you are an employee somewhere you are selling your skills your time your energy and you know whatever else to get a salary if you are a business person you are selling certain products or services everybody is selling something the value of what you are selling has to cover the cost of the things you have to buy if the value of what you are selling does not cover and exceed the cost of the things you have to buy then that means you are consuming more than you are producing and you are going to be in a financially difficult situation but sometimes what you are producing by yourself is not enough and you probably don't have the time and the bandwidth and the resources to produce more at that point in time so you look for orders that are already producing what the market wants to buy something that people want to buy people are already paying money for that thing and instead of producing your own you sell that and you get a cut of the profits is that simple that is how affiliate marketing works so you look for a product or a service that works okay then you promote it and you get paid for it i said i'm going to recommend one to you i will recommend two okay one is our own in-house athlete program which if you look at the bottom of this video you are going to find a link to which you can sign up for the athlete program you can promote our products you can promote our services and you can earn a percentage of that we see all of the details when you go to the link another athlete program which i do and that has been profitable for me is web hosting now because i have a lot of websites then in the company we have a lot of websites we build websites now whatever service you are offering you can liaise with suppliers and say okay if i refer clients to you okay what are you going to do for me you understand and many organizations actually even have that in place they have a referral program or they have an affiliate program that you can sign up for and you can promote their products or services and get paid so that's one of the things you can do you have networks you have people that ask you for advice and recommendations and you've been giving the advice and recommendations for free yes but when you advise people to use a certain product or service you can also get you know income from that so that is one of the things you can start to do okay athlete marketing so if you check the link uh, below this video you are going to be able to sign up for our whole in house athlete program and get started with that and i tell you it is very profitable because the products are able to sell you are going to even have a special promotional code that anybody that uses your code will get a special offer they are going to spend less than they should have actually spent okay because you are the one referring them so it makes it easier for you to promote okay the offer and you will have a dashboard where you can log in and see how much you have made and at the end of the month you cash out okay it's that easy so we do all of the work we set all of the systems in place to use and provide the promotional materials but you just recommend and you get paid for it now the most important benefit from this is that you are now learning how to build a business 
you are making money, okay, you are learning how to market, you are learning how to promote, okay, you are tracking your income, and in the end, at the end of the day, you are a member of the community, you see how we are doing things, and you can also do the same thing for yourself, so that is the first thing. So you want to take action by um, reviewing details of the affiliate program, and it's free to sign up, so you have nothing to lose, and you can start making money from that this week. You can start taking steps immediately after watching uh, um, this session and you can start making money this week. The second thing that you should do is to build your personal portfolio. That is why one of the first things I recommended in this program is that build your website. It's very important. If you are not in a position to get a web hosting account right now, you can team up with someone else and share the cost or you can get a cheap hosting account in the meantime and set up your website. You need somewhere that people can go to see what you have to offer, to see what you can do, and to see what you have done in the past. So your personal website can be your personal portfolio where you have details of okay the things you have done and that makes it easier for people to work with you. It makes it easier for people to see how you can add value to them because of how you have created and added value in the past then your personal portfolio also becomes like a form of a playground or a laboratory where you can test your ideas. You can test your ideas and once those ideas are successful, you can then begin to scale them into bigger things. Then what you have done for yourself, you can do for others and get paid for it. And that leads us to the third thing, which is client work. Okay, what you have done for yourself, you can now start offering those services also to clients and getting paid for those services. Now, we have talked about affiliate uh, marketing or affiliate program or referrals, okay, making money from that. We have talked about building your personal portfolio so that people can see what you have to offer and how you can create value for them. We have talked about client work, which is the things you have done for yourself that you have displayed on your portfolio, the things you have achieved. You can help others achieve those same results and that is client work. Okay, you have built a website for yourself, you can build websites for others. Okay, you have written a book for yourself, you can write books for others and get paid for it. Okay, so that is uh, client work. But client work comes with a lot of, in fact, not just client work, building business in general comes with, with a lot of intricacies that you only learn on the job. And you can learn much faster, you can make faster progress when you are in a community with others and with a mentor that has done it before. And that is the benefit of apprenticeship. Okay, so that is the fourth step you want to take. You would notice that every professional field, they have apprenticeship integrated into it. They just call it by different names. Lawyers, after they finish uh, um, you know, studying in school, they go to law school. Okay, they have finished, you know, the, in the university, they still have to go to law school. Then they have to intern. They have to intern in a law firm for a certain period. The same thing with doctors, they call it housemanship. So every professional understands it. So the apprenticeship stage of implementing what we're saying is that opportunity to gain the practical experience in addition to the foundational or basic training that you already have. And that is why we've set up Remote Work Academy. Okay, if you look at uh, below this video, if you look below this video, you're also going to find the link to get more information about Remote Work Academy. And because you are participating in this program, you are even going to get a special offer. You will find details of that offer below this video. Remote Work Academy gives you that opportunity to work on real life projects, get real life feedback. Even if you don't have the projects you are working on, we can give you projects to work on. All of these things are optional. You don't have to do it. But doing it will accelerate your journey beyond okay, what you already have now. You are going to be able to achieve your results faster. So after going through a program like this, you also need to invest in that practical side of things and see how things actually work in real life. So the fifth one is digital products. If you can create digital products and get them sold, it's going to give you a lot of freedom because one of the ways to increase your wealth rapidly is to sell products that have zero marginal cost of replication. That means whether you are producing 10 products or you are producing 1,000 products, it doesn't cost you more. The cost of producing one product is the same as the cost of producing 1,000. The cost of selling one product is the same as the cost of selling 1 million. So if you can sell 10 of your products and that shows that, yes, okay, you can get it sold. You can scale it. You can, if you can sell one, you can sell 10, you can sell 100, you can sell 1,000. 
and that just opens up limitless opportunities for you. That is the advantage of digital products. You can package your knowledge, your skills, your experience into digital products like what I am doing through this course. Now, I am speaking words to you. I am sharing my experience, but I've been able to package it in a way that creates value for you. So you want to create digital products like ebooks, online courses, training materials. There are a lot of different kinds of digital products and we're going to go through step by step how to create those products, how to launch your platform. We're going to cover all of that in Remote Work Academy. But with what you already have, you can start taking steps right now. Okay? The idea, and that's why a lot of people get overwhelmed because they want to go from A to Z. No. You should not try to go from A to Z. Try to go from A to B, from B to C, from C to D. Then after you have developed some proficiency you can jump two steps okay and move to the next do you understand okay so don't try to get the whole thing at once try to identify what is your immediate next step so take that immediate next step and then keep taking the immediate next step keep taking the immediate next step and that's why it is said that a journey of a thousand years or a thousand miles a journey of a thousand miles begins with a step so once you start taking one step after the other you keep making progress then you now get to the point where you can begin to make quantum leaps you are now no longer taking steps, but you are taking quantum leaps. But you have to start by taking steps. It's just like an aircraft that wants to take off. It will first you know, run on the wrong way, okay, pick up speed on the wrong way, then it takes off. So that is the way it is. So I've given you five things you can do now to start packaging your knowledge, your skills, your experience, your networks in such a way that you can get practical value from them. You can monetize them because it's important. You need money to... Um, take care of yourself. You need money to even grow your business. So you need to make money from your effort. It's not enough to just acquire skills. You need to be able to make money from those skills. And before you are able to create your own product, before you even start working with clients, you can start making money immediately by your word of mouth, by your referrals, by the networks you have built. And that is what athlete marketing will do for you. One of the easiest ways to start is sign up for our own in-house athlete program because that helps you to understand how athlete programs work. And then you can apply that knowledge in other areas and other products and services. What many people don't realize is that many times you have to first be an echo before you become a voice. Now, many people don't understand that you have to be an echo. You are repeating what somebody else has said. Okay, you are doing what somebody else has done. Then in the process, you now start to customize it and then you, it now becomes your own original property. That is the way it works. Okay? So that uh, brings us to the end of this session. The five steps, I'm just going to run through them. Athlete marketing, sign up for an athlete uh, program, build your portfolio, do client work, sign up for apprenticeship, and then create digital products. We're going to bring uh, this to a close at this point. If you want to go for that, which you should actually want to go for that, okay, sign up for Remote Work Academy where we can work more closely together and actually work on real life projects together, make money together. But even if you are not doing that, once you sign up for the athlete program, you will start to make money as soon as people start signing up through your athlete link or through your promo code. You have gone through this program, you have seen the value that you know, we're providing, so it should be easy for you to tell people about it. It's a matter of come and see okay, what I have experienced. And just by doing that, you make you know, good money. Thank you very much for joining us so far. I look forward to connecting with you further through our various um, communities and also in the Remote Work Academy. Thank you and bye for now.